Hello and welcome. Nice of you to stop by. So I want to address a Zach Stacy story of him beating his baby mama. It's that video that went viral, which was quite bad to say the least. This channel is set up as a bastion for men to deal with relationships and understand women nature, but also as a community, a safe haven for men to address how to become men to be in your masculine nature, how to increase your value, and to be a standard bearer. And that's my first point I want to address as one of the first lessons. Men need to be accountable and also be and so realize this, that you are the standard bearer, you are the builder, you are the protector of society. We are the ones that are first called to go to war. We are the ones that will fight another guy, if not kill him for a woman. Okay? And as such, you need to know when and how to exert that, you know, that energy, that strength. We're naturally stronger. Okay? So, there is no way I'm going to stand here and say I condone Zach Stacy's behavior under no circumstances. Okay? If you know that you know, a woman's going to, you're going to do that because a woman leave her. We are more logically based than women. All right. Women are more emotionally feelings led. If I'll say to guys, if you realize that on the pendulum or in dealing with a woman, that it's swinging towards you being more emotional in how you interact with her, I will say to you, leave that interaction and get away as far as possible, as much as you can, okay? It's not worth it. entering to that phase because, you know, you might just lose your cool, just as in this case of Zach Stacy. all right? The second thing is this. Relationships, you know, it goes through its phases. It's a mutual give and take between both genders. Men provide the leadership. They are protectors of strength, the financial resources on average. Women are the nurturers. They are the more emotionally based, more loving. Most of the time. Okay? So, if you as a man get the sense that a woman is cheating on you, you better best believe she doesn't respect you. If she's stealing from you, as in this case, he, she, he said that, she stole 500000 from him. You better best believe, drop her immediately. It's not worth continuing. It's not worth venturing into a physical interaction. Okay? Once you see that science, walk away and let the authorities deal with it. Men need to realize you can walk away. Let the authorities deal with whatever. She's following me where, where it may be. If she's this is once she's I've and I've learned this. Once she starts to argue with you, you know, pick fights, you know, start to get upset over things as if she wants to hand it, just hand it and just and just say, Hey, I realize you no longer want to be with me. So go. Let her go. Let her be someone else's problem. That's it. The third point is this. Societies today. In these Western societies, the empowerment of women, the equality of women's rights, is a bedrock of, of, of the nations that we live in. Okay? And as such, because of this, as a male, you have a different standard. And as such, as a male, you cannot just hit a woman all willingly. You cannot just express your masculine, natural masculine nature of being physical with a woman. The moment you even, a woman sees, just senses a whiff of you're going to assault her, you're going to have charges swept against you. Okay? He's looking at least, at least 10 years for this. <laughs> okay? He's not escaping this. So I don't know what he's thinking doing this. He lost his school. Bruh. It's just. And on top of it. He's a black man beating a white woman. 
oh my goodness, society how already has a stereotype, a stigma as a black guy. You already have two, three, four strikes right here against you. Why are you in danger in your life? Now he has destroyed his life at this point. He forever be branded as a woman beater, a domestic violence perpetrator. Okay, that's how it is. What, what, what is he thinking? I don't get it. You know, sometimes, guys, you know, we need to come to a, a point where controlling your emotions. We need to learn to do that. Um, and also, I think in the case of Zach Stacy, and as as in some men, when they grow up where they see their moms being a their mom being abused by their father, you know, they think that's the right way to do it. Or in some cases, it, he was he was bullied himself. Irrespective of that, that is no excuse to hit a woman just because she's like, you know, disrespecting you, she cheating you, whatever. No excuse. I've learned to just walk away, man. <laughs> That's my cue, walk away. It's not worth the squeeze, it's not worth the fight. Because now he's just, he has destroyed his life. He didn't make a lot of money in the NFL because he was a fifth round pick. Okay, he bounced from team to teams. He worked hard to get there, you know, he had to hurt his way. She didn't have to. She's a woman. That's her value. We have to earn it. Now he's just throwing the weight just because of a uh, loss of school. You know what I'm saying? But in any case, guys, you know, he will get what is rightfully deserved to him by the extent of the law. And I hope we t men take this as a lesson as how to deal with relationships. You know, if you know you cannot deal with a woman, if you know that you are toxic yourself, fix it. Go to therapy. If you know that you're attracting certain women and for whatever reason it's just not working out, then be alone. Nothing's wrong being alone. But that's my two cents. What do you guys think? Please comment, like, and subscribe. Until then, peace.